hey guys my name is omo thank you so much for stopping by so in this video i'm going to be sharing with you guys on how i keep myself as a woman also on how i get rid of bobs after shaving and also how i um make my body smell good and nice okay so keep watching and ensure to watch till the end So right now i'm going to uh first of all shave my armpit to be using my shaving stick it's called gillette blue 11 so i'm going to be using it why the reason why i'm using this shaving stick is because the shaving stick is very very good for me it doesn't cost me any bobs after shaving the reason why i'm using it so though you can use any other um shaving stick that work best for you so but for me i love using this shaving stick it comes in um in five pairs okay so this is the last one remaining so I'm, i just decided to like okay let me use this one to make a video to show to you guys how i take care of myself as a woman so that's what i'm doing so first of all before then i need to wet my armpits okay because definitely i'm not going to be shaving on a dry body so i'm going to be using this um snail white um soap is a whitening soap actually it, i normally use it to shave my armpit and also my baby when i mean baby my down part as a woman i use it in the sense of um, it helps to lighten up my skin so that's the reason why i'm using it so that's what i'm doing in this video you can go ahead and um browse about the soap the soap is very good it's a whitening soap i just love the fragrance and the fact that it helps to lighten up my skin that's my armpits and my bikini line so though i'm rubbing it on my baby that's my down part i'm not really putting it inside my body so guys as you can see in the video i don't really have hair under my armpit that's because i normally shave every two weeks so normally um apply the same soap on my armpit then leave it for some time before washing it off right now um as you guys can see in the video how neat and uh, clean my armpit is my armpit is not dark and right i'm going to be shaving my damper so obviously you guys will not be watching me shaving my damper so <laughs> let me finish it and why you go ahead and browse about the soap after shaving my armpit and also my damper so the next thing to do right now is to exfoliate my skin so right now i'm going to be using this um la fresh body scrub i don't know if you guys watched my previous video where i did a review about this product the reason why i did a review on on this particular product was because it's very very good it's a body scrub that you can use on your face and also on your skin that's your body so that's the reason why i choose to um go with this um, body scrub that's the reason why i stick with this body scrub because it's very mine on the skin and also it's an exfoliating body scrub it's really helped to get rid of every form of dead skin cells from your skin so that's why um, i'm using this body scrub so i'm going to use it to scrub my armpit and also my damp part going to scrub all over my body with the scrub god ah guys the fragrance that is coming out from this scrub i really cannot um resist to like not to scrub all over my body so i just i decided to like use this opportunity to scrub all over my body so um meanwhile this crop comes in different um fragrance it comes in a uh, strawberry fragrance you have um different fragrance mango papaya lemon so it comes in different 
flavor so um this flavor that i'm using is actually um uh, cucumber flavor so i actually love the fragrance that is coming out from this scrub like i'm using it to scrub my body just i just feel like eating the scrub but don't eat it so yeah don't eat it guys <laughs> don't mind me guys so that's what i'm doing in this video i'm actually scrubbing my whole body in this video so keep watching and enjoy the music at the background So once you're scrubbing your body please concentrate on your knuckles your um elbows your nails so concentrate on those parts of your body it's really really important as and also concentrate on your um bikini lines when you're scrubbing and also your bum bum when you're scrubbing so all those areas please when you're scrubbing your body please concentrate on those areas on your body they are very very um no the uh, the parts on that body is hard so to uh for something to penetrate into it is very very hard so you scrubbing it it helps to um the the lotion or the oil whatsoever you're using to apply on your body to penetrate and blend with your body so i would advise you to always scrub those areas when you're scrubbing your skin so guys after scrubbing myself i allow the scrub to stay on my body for some time okay so now um the reason why i allow the scrub to stay on my body for some time before resting it off is because um you know all those uh, wash off product um you can just wash it off immediately do so i'll advise you when you ever you're using a wash off product like your whitening shower gel or your shower gel or your scrub your body scrub or soever soap you're using i'll advise you to always leave it on your body for some time before you rinse it off ingredient that is being used to produce it to penetrate into your skin so that it will give you the effect of what the product is meant to do so that's just one thing about the wash off product i will, I will advise you guys to take note of so that's what i did in this in this video in particular so after scrubbing i had to uh, stand in the bathroom for like 10 minutes before resting it off so that's just it guys Because remember i told you guys this scrub is meant for face and body so i'm actually going to scrub my face with it because i need to exfoliate my face as well so that's what i'm doing so after um scrubbing all over my body so i decided to scrub my face so because i want to have a smooth and flawless face as usual so that's why i just need to scrub my face to get rid of every form of dead skin cells that is on my face and also depth that is remaining on my face though i have i know i just um shower so but i needed to scrub it as well to remove the excess oil and the rest of it so so i know most of you will be asking why am i um scrubbing it with strength like that i really do not apply pressure scrubbing it <laughs> i don't know why the video turned out to look as if i'm applying pressure scrubbing my face i really do not apply pressure scrubbing my face actually the scrub is not really that harsh on the skin it's a mind body scrub so that's just what i'm doing in the video guys <laughs>
next i will go with my beats dean femi daily wash okay so um this daily wash is actually good for me whenever i use it i feel so refreshed and also um clean or um, contains natural ingredients like um aloe vera and the rest of it so that's the reason why i love it so much and the fact that it contains prebiotic that can help to keep the good um, bacterias on my on my vjj nourished so that's the reason why i love it so much and the fact that it contains natural ingredients like aloe vera okay, you all know that aloe vera is very very good so that's the reason why i love it you can go ahead um, um and check for a good uh femi um daily wash that you can use to keep your vjj clean and especially those that normally sweat on your vjj due to the fact that you're putting on a pant that is not even um cutting that's why it's advisable to always put a pant that is cutting that's just the best because you putting on all those net pants it's actually cause infection i'm a testimony of that that's why i stop using uh any pant that has net i normally go for cutting 100 percent cutting so that's the best pants i i can recommend for you for you guys so so after washing my body with the feminine um daily wash then i had to wash my body with this johnson baby wash so this is a bath glove i actually purchased it in here in malaysia it's very very affordable you can get it easily in the market it's good for exfoliating okay if you want to exfoliate your when you're using this um glove sponge to sponge your body i would advise you to also concentrate on your bikini lines on your private area that's where you just scrubbed your armpit and the rest of it okay just concentrate on those parts of your body and also your thighs just concentrate on those parts of your body and use it to scrub it's actually good for scrubbing people will be asking why didn't i go for my normal body wash to wash my skin um no um i decided to use this body wash because i've been using it for quite some time not really quite some time i've been using it for some time before i started formulating my own product so i'm kind of um used to the fairground that sometimes don't want to use my own um body wash like my whitening body wash i just choose to like okay since i've been using my body wash for like for months now okay let me take a break and then switch to this so that's just the way i normally do okay that's the way i keep my routine i don't just use um whitening body wash for for almost long period of time no because i don't want to damage my skin so my 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 omg guys look how beautiful look how smooth my skin look okay that's one thing about exfoliating scrub once you scrub your skin god you so much love your skin you see the glow you see the beauty you see how flawless your skin will look and how smooth it will look okay so as you can see my armpit all oh, my armpit is so clean my armpit is not dark i don't have a dark armpit or a dark ties or dark bikini line because i actually take care of myself and actually scrub myself at the same time because it helps to remove every form of hyperpigmentation and depth from your skin so as you can see how flawless how clean my skin look ah i so much love my skin <laughs>
now this is the part i would like you guys to pay attention to i have my uh have my turmeric powder i have my uh vera gel also i have my bowl with me that i will use to mix the ingredients I have my miracle powder. And also, I have my brush. So this is my brush. As you can see, the amount of the brush that I've been using it. Um, this right here, I'm about to mix this uh, mixture. Apply on my armpit and my bikini line also with my private area now i know most of you will be like uh won't it be harsh or won't it um give me any form of irritation no it won't okay normally like using it that particular day that i just shaving myself okay why i love doing it just to help bobs that will reoccur after my shaving so that's the reason why i love using it on that particular day and also thing you should know is this i would advise you to make a little batch of this um mixture because i don't really like um making large batch because it's a waste so i'll advise you to make little batch of what you can use for that day if you want to do again for the next day you can do another fresh uh, mi uh mixture okay so right here i have my turmeric powder you all know turmeric powder that turmeric powder is very very good it contains antioxidant and also anti-inflammatory components which helps to glow and also um brighten up the skin naturally so now one why i choose to uh, mix turmeric powder into this mixture is because now you want to lighten up your dark ties which is dark so with the help of turmeric it's going to lighten up and also your armpit at the same time and also your private area so that's the reason why i choose turmeric in this mixture now the next is our um aloe vera gel you all know aloe vera gel that it contains a lot of um natural um properties and also it's also helped to heal okay it helps to heal so that's why i choose um aloe vera as well and also i have my uh miracle powder you all know that miracle powder has a healing property and also help in a stretch mark it also help in a aftershave especially aftershave for those of you that don't know that very good um ingredient to use when you're having um ups on your private area you actually can use um turmeric powder just mix it with a little water and apply it there okay so one thing about this uh, mixture is that it's not going to be harsh on your skin you just have this sensational feeling not really that harsh on your skin and also the uh, next thing you have to mix the ingredient together and apply it on your armpit and also on your bikini line your ties and also on your private areas so So guys now i'm applying it on my armpits so after that i will apply it on my private area why i have this little um stretch mark on my armpit that's close to my uh, armpit as you can see the one i'm showing to you guys in the video that was when i was uh, pregnant of my son so i was just having this um stretch mark on my armpit and um, some parts of my body but as for the armpits um that's because my hand was uh, getting big i was fat or oh, no you know what comes with pregnancy so um but with the use of this um mixture i noticed that it's fed away gradually you can see i only just have just um black spots there so to tell you that this mixture is very very effective and also good one thing you should know about this mixture is that it just uh, requires um 
patience okay patient and consistent in your consistency and your patience you definitely going to get a result it's also going to help to clear off any form of stretch mark if you're having stretch mark on your armpit if you have a dark spot you're having burps and the rest of feet just try out this mixture is a home remedy it's everything i use in this um in this mixture is not really that expensive okay so it's effective um remedy that you can use personally on yourself without uh, any stress it's not harmful you all know turmeric you all know aloe vera so it's not harmful so it's very very good to use on your skin so guys um right now i'm washing it off after um leaving the mixture on my private area and also on my armpit for close to 15 minutes then after rinsing it off with water then i'll go in and um, use my sponge and my soap to actually um clean it properly you all know turmeric it stains the body so i don't want it to stain my dress so that's why i'm using my sponge and soap to wash it off properly so that's just what i'm doing so you guys can see my armpit is very very clean you see the stains of um turmeric is still in my armpit so that's why i needed to wash it off with the soap and sponge just to get rid of the stain because i won't want it to stain my dress like i said earlier on and meanwhile the mark i'm showing to you guys is the stretch mark that i was talking about so that's the mark that is in my close to my armpit so but it's fading away gradually due to the fact that i'm using this mixture like i said earlier on so that's just to see how clean and fresh and bright my armpits look also um with my private area sorry i can't show it off if not i would have showed to you guys okay so um the that's the way my armpit is that's the same way my uh, private area is because i clean it up and also i use this mixture so it really helps me a lot um <laughs> this is the final section of my routine so guys um i'll be adding uh, one cup of detour inside the bucket and also i'll be adding um one spoon of salt inside the same hot water then i had to like sit on top of it to steam my bum bum and another thing the fact that i'm steaming my bubble you also it also helps to get rid of any form of bobs that is shaving bobs that will reoccur. nivea bb oil okay so i love it because it contains a uh, sweet almond oil so because definitely i'm not going to leave it dry so i'm going to moisturize my armpit the roll i'm showing to you guys is a nivea roll which i'll be leaving a picture of it there so this that's what i'm i'm using right from time so um as for the um baby oil i just started using it um recently since i gave birth to my son so i just started using it because i love the fragrance so and it's really good to um use oils to moisturize your 
um bikini line your ties and your armpit because it's very very good because that alone will help to keep it moisturized so that's what i'm doing so i'm applying it on my armpit then after much i'm going to use my ruler so if you love this video and you find this video very very helpful please do not forget to give this video a whole thumbs up and also if you haven't subscribed to my channel and you've been watching my video please ensure to subscribe and i guess i'll see you all in my next video bye